Hi everyone, this is Amy. Welcome to my channel. I just got my Misfits box and we're gonna get it open together. It's only one box this time, but it's kind of heavy. I don't remember what I ordered, so we're gonna get it open and find out. But first, this is not sponsored. I paid for everything in here. But if you wanna give Misfits a try, there's a link in the description down below where you can save off your first order. And I'll save a little bit off my next order. So it's a win-win for both of us. Okay, let's get this box open and find out what's inside. We have an ice pack. And in this case, the useless piece of cardboard is holding up that ice pack. And it got the useless piece of cardboard wet. So maybe we need to say that this time it's a useful piece of cardboard. What do you think? Is it? I think it might be. We have some Dave's Killer Bread English muffins. Some portobello mushroom caps, and there's three in here. Sometimes we only get two, but this time we got three. Some thyme, leeks, and we got two. Remember when they were calling them leeks? Oh, there's three actually. Wow, that's awesome. Remember when they were calling it leeks plural, and you only got one leek? Well, now I got three leeks. That is awesome. Thank you, Misfits. Thank you for actually giving me what I think I'm getting some rosemary, baby bella mushrooms, some really nice, fresh feeling, fresh feeling, is that a thing? I mean, it feels fresh. You get what I mean, right? You do? I hope. I don't sound like a lunatic. Well, I might sound like a lunatic, but you like to watch me anyway, right? Maybe? Celery. Zucchini. These look good. Oh, I'm so excited. Thin asparagus. You know, I always want the thin asparagus, and most of the time when you order asparagus from Misfits, Imperfect, any of the companies, Farmbox, you get really, really fat asparagus. This is the tiny, thin asparagus. I love it. I'm thrilled with that. We got green beans, and these are the French haricot vert, and it's one whole pound in here, which most other companies only give you eight ounces. So it's nice that Misfit gives you a pound. This looks like a sweet potato, but I don't remember ordering sweet potato. Maybe I did. Oh, I, stay with me until the end. I'm gonna go over my receipt with you so that we can make sure we got everything we're supposed to and so that you know what I paid for everything in here because I don't remember. I'm gonna go over that. Hang in there with me. Got some limes, lots of limes actually. Wow, five limes. They're good looking limes too scallions and some of these aren't like it's ew, there's some slimy ones in there Ugh. but most of them are okay some baby spinach it's open and smushed that's why i call this the useless piece of cardboard because it doesn't prevent that from happening it would have to be much thicker and much more durable to prevent smashing there is a company called good Shop that uses a really great system with a tray that fits in the box. So, oh, and they have a little tray that they keep the dry ice in. That's nice. Instead of that useless piece of cardboard that Misfits puts over their boxes, and this is that useless piece of cardboard, this flimsy piece of cardboard. Those of you that order from Misfits or watch my Misfits unboxings, Good Shop has a tray and it's sturdy. It tells you more about them. So, you know what? Misfits could learn a little something from this. I know there's a lot of people out there that defend Misfits and say, oh, you know, it is useful, blah, blah, blah. It saved my food. There's better ways to do it because I get all my food delivered. I rarely go to a store. I know that sounds crazy, but I really rarely do go to a store. I send Colin to the store, he goes, but I don't go. Considering I've gotten 
food delivered from dozens of different companies, I've seen the best and the worst ways to do it. This is one of the worst ways to do it. That doesn't mean I don't like Misfits. I do. I think Misfits is the best value for your money, but that is just not a great system. Two more sweet potatoes. These look good. Broccoli. This looks good. Some Meyer lemons. And oh, I forgot to say, all of this is organic, by the way. Multicolored carrots. These look nice. They're really thin, but they look very fresh. It's nice when it's fresh. Fennel. That's a big fennel. Another lime. That's six limes, right? Who's counting? The number of the day is six. Six limes. I just keep buying this. I'm afraid they're gonna run out of it. The Chosen Foods Avocado Oil Mayo. It's such a good price compared to what you would get it for at the store that I just keep getting it. I dropped a piece of fennel. This is interesting. Hmm. Oh, so this is just heat and go. I thought this was a mix that I had to make. That's kind of nice. Thai lime rice. It does have sunflower oil in it. Cane sugar, but it is organic. In a pinch, when I need to make something fast, that could be a lifesaver. The take and bake French loaf. We love this bread. And if you haven't tried this bread yet, you need to try it. Here's something interesting. Let me show you this. This was just kind of open like this. This is the cold pack and it wasn't sealed and it's just open. That's not good. These are still frozen, so that's good. There's two ice packs that are frozen. Yogurt. I don't know why they have to tape these together. Actually, you know who had the best Greek yogurt? Imperfect Foods. The Imperfect Foods brand of Greek yogurt is awesome. I got it last time from Imperfect Foods and it was really, really good. Highly recommend that. We got some eggs. Let's see how these are because the way this is all tossed in here, I'm not too sure. And these are the organic eggs. Last time I got confused. And I ordered free range, but non-organic in addition to organic. But these, these look good. Nothing's broken, I don't think. No, they're good. And the expiration date, April 22nd. That's pretty good. And another carton of eggs. These look good too, nothing's broken. I just stepped on the piece of fennel that fell on the floor. I forgot it was there. It freaked me out. Use my March 24th. Some sour cream. This is Organic Valley. Can you see that? Yeah, okay. Some pepperoni so that I can make some pizza. The organic cheddar cheese. I love this stuff. This is really good cheese. If you haven't tried it, I highly recommend it. Grass-fed burgers. And I had ordered these last time and I got bacon instead of burgers. But now we got the burgers. Feta cheese. There are, I think this is too many ice packs. There are three ice packs in the bottom. And remember, there was one on top. Let me just make sure I got it. I do. Remember, there was one on top of the whole box. And then there was another on top of the cold pack. Or two. two. So that's like five, six. Six or seven ice packs in here. I feel like that's too many, especially considering there have been times where they haven't used any ice packs at all. 
All right, let me show you what this looks like, and then I'm gonna go over my receipt. Here's what all the vegetables in the sink look like. And then over here, we have our other stuff. Eggs and our bread. So now that receipt. So the eggs were two for $5.98. The lemons were one for $4.19. That's a little higher than it has been. The organic limes were six, and it says small, but they're not small at all. Like these are normal size and actually a little large limes. And we did get six. Six! For $2.69. The rosemary was $1.99. The thyme was $1.99. The green beans were $3.99, and that's for a full pound of organic French green beans. That's very nice. The baby bella mushrooms were $2.69. The zucchini was two for $2.19. The broccoli was $3.69, and that's for two heads of broccoli. The asparagus was $4.49. The celery was $1.99. The carrots were $2.39. The spinach, that's open and a little smushed. 329. The organic portobello mushroom caps were 329. The sweet potatoes were 3 for $1.99. That's a good deal. The leeks were 429. Fennel was 259. Scallions were $1.39. The Dave's Killer Classic English muffins 429. The French bread, the take and bake organic artisan bread, that was 399. The organic yogurt, whole milk, plain yogurt was $3.99. The sour cream was $2.29. The feta was $4.99. The organic sharp cheddar cheese was six ounces for $3.99. The grass-fed burgers were a pound for $6.49. That's a really good deal. The mayonnaise, the chosen foods, avocado oil mayonnaise, that was for $4.99. It's a little higher than it has been. It was $3.99, but it's still much less than it would be at Whole Foods. The going price there has been $8.49, so we're saving quite a bit. The Thai lime rice is $1.99. That's good for a staple just to have. The pepperoni was $3.99, so my total was $96.11. Shipping was $4.50. But thanks to some of you, I had $80 in credits. That's because a lot of you used my code in the description down below and you saved some money off of your order and I saved money off of this order. So thank you for that. I appreciate it. So my total was $20.61. Misfit says that's a savings of $35.68. What do you think? Is this a good value for my money? Have you tried Misfits? Have you had good experiences with them? Leave me a comment down below and let me know. Remember, I post videos every week. At least one of them is an unboxing. So if you like that kind of content, be sure to subscribe and ring the bell so that you never miss a video. This is Amy. Happy organic eating. I will see you real soon. Thank you for watching. Bye.